Leading into the winter snow season, a lot of the health risks that we will expect to see with people can come in the form of the heart risk associated with a lot of the physical exertion, particularly related to shoveling snow, which can very quickly, within 10 minutes, get your heart rate up to 95% of heart rate max. That's a big risk because a lot of people don't normally bring their heart rate up that high. A bunch of things that you could do to reduce your risk of any heart-related acute events during this winter snow season would be obviously a proper warm-up five to ten minutes of a lot of dynamic movements things that are going to get your heart rate elevated a little bit that's going to slowly turn on all the different systems associated with the heart and the lungs and things like that there's two things that you want to look at when someone is shoveling the snow when you have different types of shovel uh, one of them is don't overdo it the other big thing would be your proper form and technique so as you're lifting the shovel you don't want to round your back you sort of stick out your chest and pinch your shoulder blades and then as you're lifting it's really hard if you're in that position to round your back out. One of the things you want to bring from this would be awareness. Awareness about safety, awareness about proper technique uh, and along with that a lot of the signs and symptoms that you should be looking out for uh, if something bad is going on. Internal signs regarding your cardiovascular system, uh, excessive shortness of breath, headaches, uh, any chest pain, those things might be signs that you're going to want to stop and definitely take a break, but you may want to consider, depending on the severity, if they don't go away when you stop exercising, then you may want to contact you know, a physician or things like that. So pay attention, listen to your body. Now you have a lot of you know, fitness watches that have an optical heart rate where the heart rate is built into the actual watch band itself. One of the things that we want to use that for would be to potentially avoid overexertion or getting your heart rate up too high.